Good morning and welcome. Just to start, some housekeeping. At the conclusion of today's ceremony, there will be light refreshments, tea and coffee available in the function room just on the opposite side of the chapel. Also, in the event of a fire, please note that the exit is the door that you came through this morning. I'd like to thank everyone for coming today. We have been brought together through a terrible tragedy. Harold Smith, fondly known as Harry, was a father, a son, a nephew, a friend, and a colleague. If you were ever needing help, he would be right around the corner. Harry has touched so many lives, and this is evident by every single person in this room today. Even though I didn't know Harry personally, I know through meeting his friends and family over the last couple of weeks that he would have been proud of each and every one of you. I hope there is some peace in knowing that Harry is with the love of his life, Marion, who left us five years ago. Harry was survived by his daughter, Tempest, his sons, Adrian, Christian, and Eric, and also his grandsons, Zale, Dylan, Kai, and Fletcher. I would now like to ask Harry's son, Christian, to come up and deliver the eulogy. <coughs> Thank you, Christian, for those beautiful words. I would now like to ask Harry's daughter, Tempest, to come up and read a poem that has been selected by the family. This poem is called, Do Not Stand at My Grave and Weep by Mary Elizabeth Fry. <coughs> Thank you, Tempest, for that beautiful poem. We will now be listening to one of Harry's favorite songs, Tears in Heaven by Eric Clapton. As this song plays, I invite the family to come up and place a flower with Harry at this time. <clears throat> Thank you for the family that have placed a flower with Harry today. I know that today is a hard day, but knowing that Harry is looking down on you or with a big smile on his face, and he'd no doubt be off to catch his next fish. I ask you now to recite the Lord's Prayer with me. Can you please now stand for the committal? Harry, we lovingly and respectfully return your body to the elements from which it came. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust, we leave you now in peace and are grateful you are in our lives. <laughs> <laughs> 